We're the Rock Team at the University of Minnesota. We started this project about three weeks before the deadline because that's when the school year started. And so we had a really quick uptake of how to get people up to speed and then immediately go into design and immediately go into building. They kind of pitched it as a good way to learn a lot of the basics really fast. We decided to go with uh, carbon fiber, fiberglass, and 3D printed plastic for pretty much the entirety of our rocket. We didn't have much time to test our concept, and so we had to, we had to put it together the first time and hope that it worked. So on launch day, uh, we suffered a failure in one of our key electronic components. Our electronics physically came apart. We actually had some soldering break on our wiring. We had a faulty valve that was leaking pressure on launch. So we only hit half of the pressure that we were going to launch at, which cost us a lot of altitude. My roommate described as a quiet car ride home. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> we still decided to enter the competition because we believed that we had something special. So I mean, we sent it in and then here we are, we qualify. We used the 3D printing technology that the engineering school has. On the top of our rocket, we have our nose cone, which is then connected to our main part of the rocket, which is the body tube. Inside of the rocket, there's a parachute, an altimeter, which tells you how high you've gone, and an electronic circuit board that has a microprocessor. We've gone through several versions of our rocket. We're at about version five. I believe our rocket should win because we built it light, we built it strong, it's been optimized, so I think just the amount of time and detail we've put into things like that is really going to help us to achieve the highest altitude. It'd be super cool to be in the Guinness Book of World Records. You always think about how cool it would be, like, oh, what if I was in this book? I never would have imagined that in my first semester through Rocket Team I'd be able to do something of this caliber. When we found out the news, uh, we were all excited and going crazy. That call to my parents was very exciting. My dad was really pumped and my mom was just out because she's my mom. <laughs> I think we've optimized it so we don't have any more mass than we need to have. Maximum pressure, lightest weight, that should get us the highest.